Wagwan Massive, I'm Fziba. Welcome or welcome back to my channel where I share with you what I do to live naturally on a budget. Now, a few of you requested that I post the retrial of the mango butter video, so this is that video. Big shout out to Queen Nerd, Chloe, Gerd, and all of you who have requested that I redo this experiment. So, I already went ahead and removed the kernel from the mango seed. So if you want to see how I do that um, part of the process, I'm going to refer you back to the first video where I actually showed you all of the, um, the different phases. Now I'm going to roast these now and this is a step that I missed in the first video. So yeah, we're going to put on the pot now. This is generally how I feel the material I'm working with. This is very hot right now, so yeah, I know that the heat has really gone through it. So I'm gonna remove the pot from the flame and we're going to grind this out to paste. So here's what the mango kernels are looking like at this point. So at this point I'm pouring in some water Here I am pressing the paste for traces of oil residue. So I allow this to boil. I started this project at about 7 in the morning and I was not finished until about 6 o'clock in the evening. So it was really a long process. Here I removed the butter from the flame and I was just allowing this to cool down. And I'm just pouring some water in it to see if any oil would rise to the top. That was not the case so I had to strain the mixture and still no oil residue and so my next thing was although i don't have that in this video my next thing was to put the batter into the freezer for a couple of hours to see if it would harden now here i'm just showing you my hands so that you can see the consistency you can see here that the mixture it was oily and it was very sticky all right, so when I got to this point, I actually thought I was going to get some oil, but it just never moved from this glossy phase. And so what I actually did after this phase was to pour some more water in to see if any oil would rise to the top, and that still was not the case. So here it is again. Um, this is the consistency. It was very oily and sticky. Alright, so I'm just returning it to the flame right here again and I was just trying to see if it would boil down to oil. There was just this film on the top of it and this film went nowhere. My own conclusion is that I used the wrong method of extraction. I don't believe the water was sufficient to extract the oil from the mango kernels and in my research I see where they use ethanol or some kind of alcohol based solvent to extract the oil from the kernel so I guess that's where I went wrong so this is what it looks like it came out more like a pudding and yeah this is my mango butter family it just looked like a pudding now that's it for this video if you have any tips remember you can always share them and thank you for watching see you in the next video